No cicadas. This is the very this is a very weird thing to be happening indeed, is it not? No cicadas, a very normal title screen. Music is nonetheless ominous, however. June goes great. How goes for you? Hope you are well. I'm about to stream your video game. Oh wow, per <laughs> we're still in perfect sync then. John, Sayara, June. Hope three of you are doing well this fine evening. People told me this video game's good. So I'm very excited. You hear it's okay? Interesting. Remnants was super rad. I liked it a lot. I played a very, very early version of this, so I know what to expect. Like, I still have a version where there's, like, no collision on any of the walls. <laughs> That's pretty fun. You are giving yourself a lot of hell in this project, which is why I'm glad it seems to be catching on. Um, so, yeah, I've been very excited for it myself, so, hopefully the fact that people are into this can, can kind of, has, has sort of made a little bit of that, uh, uh, a little bit of that stress, uh, you know, you know, go away, hopefully it feels better <laughs> knowing that, oh wait, yeah, it's good. You're done with that? Good, good, good. We'll get started here in another couple minutes. I'm just hanging back here, waiting for some people to roll in. Oh. It's a three-day weekend. So that's good stuff. Three-day weekend, suck my butt. Three-day weekend, suck my butt. Something like that. That's how I imagined it in my head when I posted it earlier. It sounded exactly like that song. Oh, you got let out of work three hours earlier, so you... Oh, nice, nice, nice. Right the next Saturday. Then you woke up and played Labyrinth. Nice. Yeah, the week seemed to have beaten you down rather successfully, John. I'm doing, I don't know, are these gamer things? Hey, that rock, how's it going? This is a friend of mine's video game they just released. They're in the chat. Um, it's supposed to be really cool. I was really into their last game, Remnants. Uh, and this is kind of a fun little follow-up. Not directly related, I don't think, so. 
This title screen music reminds me of some of the more ambient stuff on the Fragile. Oh, you're streaming. Oh, are you the restreamer um, that they're doing for uh, the PlayStation thing this evening? Oh, only for Rhea's run? Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Seeing somebody, like, I know, like, like Siphon's doing uh, Die Hard and Die Hard with a Vengeance here in about a half hour. It's like, man, I haven't played those games in fucking... God! I literally probably have not played the Die Hard trilogy since 1996. The RE2 run later tonight? Yeah, I'll probably be able to catch that. All right, but we are here to check out my good friend June Flower's new game, Labyrinth Derelict Abyss. This is good stuff. Let us go. Oh, settings. Right, right, right. Go. There we go. Dot, dot, dot. <laughs> what the yeah RPD stand for wrong answers only you are fully formed do what you must okay Look at me I've got I've got those little fish cakes you get in udon on my face So we got okay only objects with a blinking outline can be interacted with This is a lovely lovely setting we've got going on here already Hello, okay, yeah, okay. Time till teeth, about 30 seconds. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this little guy. This is having a lot of fun down there, I'm sure. That is probably nowhere I want to go. Hello. Hello. Yo, this is a tune. Relic obtained. Fail. You didn't tell me you put me in the game? June, you did not tell me that I was in this video game. Holy crap. You. The relief your existence brings me is immeasurable. As you can see, I was unsuccessful. However, I have faith that you'll not suffer the same fate. I wish you the best of luck and thank you. Okay. Thank you to me. Cool. I appear in yet another video game. Oh, dude. Look at this guy. He's having some fun. Collect all 12 relics to open the gates. Hints. Hints! Look, there are hints here, guys. Guys, guys. There's hints. I am the hint machine! I can help you find relics! Do you require my aid? No, I'm good. Understood. Ooh! 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 Get a listen at this shit! Ooh! Ooh! <laughs> I found the game! <laughs> the gate before it's... Okay, so... I'm gonna say, I don't think the fact that, um, the fact that not everything in this game is interactable, I don't think that that's affecting this at all already. Like, there's already so much ambiance here. Like, there's, like, it does not matter that this is not like Remnants. Like, this definitely has its own energy. And, like, the environment is already telling the story for me. I don't need words to do that. Yeah, this track is a fucking jam. Hello down there, little guy. 
are you doing? You're probably dead. It's okay, though. I'm dead, too. Inside. Yeah, like, I, I'm like I'm only a couple minutes in, and I already think, like, if all of this stuff was interactable and me would, like, and I'd be stopping to explore everything, I think that that would have been the wrong move here. But I think I said as much when I saw the original uh, version. Hello. Everything I, every weird thing I see is literally just a hello moment. How are you doing there? You having fun? Can I pet it? Okay, I can't pet it. Kind of bummed, not gonna lie. Yo, this is another banger uh, already as well. Hello, maggot brain thing. Hello. Looks lovely up in there. Oh, there's one. Relic obtained, Pamphor. I am Pamphor, the limp scholar. Through lymph, through lymph tracing, I created this place. And yet, all that remains of me is this dark stain, my research fruitless. I summoned you here. As such, I believe you deserve to know why. The labyrinth traps us. Beyond our existence, we remain stuck here as relics. Gather us and leave this place. We will be free and so shall you. Now go. May you be successful. <laughs> Twelve minutes till first worm. Yo, big old books. You know, this is this book right here is my jam. I want to know what's in this book. I need to be able to read this book. Okay. Oh, there's one over there too. This is lovely. There we go. I wondered when we were gonna get to an autopsy. Okay, that's a door. Hello? Wait. Okay. Whoa! What? What the f- What? <laughs> Wait. That's a- what is this effect? Is that like a default effect? I've never seen that. Why is there a butt on a book? I don't know. Hey Beepner, how's it going? Hey Beepner, if you're still around and like... By the time I finish this... Um, maybe you'll want to come on. I got something planned. But we'll find... We'll see. If you don't want to, you don't have to. This is really cool. What in the world? This is so neat! Oh my god! What the fuck? This is rad as fuck! Relic obtained, Wheel of Dolor. Hello, you! We are all born into this world with the burden of having to care. The distinction is whether whether or not you choose to discard it. I have tried not to do for I have tried not to for my entire life, but I cannot blame the beings who do. Big relate. Big ol' relate. Uh I've I am using I don't use Skype anymore, Beepner, I use Discord. <laughs> So I would just Discord call you. Can I go in the water? What? Oh, are you fucking for real? This is fucking cool as shit. This is cool as shit. Look at this. I'm a fucking fish. There's another one. Okay. 
Okay, now where am I? I am in Greenland. Hey, bug, 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 bug! So many bugs! They're everywhere! Somebody dropped their bugs. Oh, hey, it's Greenland. Relic obtained, scree! Scree? Yo, it's that it's it's trails in the sky. That's what that's what Chloe's bird says. It says spree. Oh! Hey! Found the brainwashing center. I found the brainwashing room. This is where they make me watch commercials all day. Eventually I will buy pizza because of this room. Oh, good, good. This looks happy. This looks happy. I like the, look at this shit. Look at the flowers up here, or these leaves. I like the little effect going on here. Okay, we're back here. Okay, we're, okay, so we're in the poo water. That's what the green is, we're in poo water. a hub? Wait. Okay. Yeah, okay. Because I was noticing, I've, I've seen these little marks already. I was like, okay, so this is how we get... Okay, so we've got, we got some, we got some... Oh, hello. Oh, Jesus! Okay. Oh, Okay. Ain't that a happy face? Yeah, and more little worm. And this, this is a, this is a thing that happened. This is a thing that happened. Okay, okay. So I know we're about where we're at again. Oh, oh, hello. Don't look at me. You can't fucking see me. worms in the eyes. That's a double tune moment. Can we go in here? Can we go in here? Okay. 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 Now you look like what's his name? You look like you look you look like wheel boy with hands. Okay, now we're back in Greenland. That's where you come from from Worm World. No, this is where... Okay, okay. Wait, 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 wait. Fill this one in using your imagination. What? <laughs> what? Can I get over there? <laughs> okay. Oh, it's a it's an art joke. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I'm using the. I'm always using my imagination. Yo, oh, hey! I'm just playing the Binding of Isaac up in here. Hey, I see you. I see you. Hey, here's another one. Materia. As you traverse these rooms, you might think of this place as a carefully constructed, coherent structure. It is the easy thing to assume, but that would be untrue. The more I study it, the more I realize this place is closer to a stain, dripping, dripping stochastically under the effect of gravity. There is no purpose to the frame of these walls. However, that doesn't mean that they are devoid of meaning. I see... I see, it as a I see it as a vandalism in the notion of the place itself, but that is just my own deduction. 
and I'm just a big glowing thing suspended in the air, so what do I know, really? You. I had a feeling. I had a feeling. Aha! Uh Aha! -huh. Aha! Uh -huh. You thought you were gonna get one over on me. You thought you were gonna Faerun me. But it is I who Faeruned you. Don't know how that makes sense, but that's how I'm gonna look at it. Oh, Jesus Christ! Hi! That's pleasant. Okay! 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 I saw this and I was not sure. This right, like I saw these down here, and I was not sure. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, I think I already... Uh, yeah, okay. Okay, I see how it all connects now. Okay, I got you. I got you, boo. Wait, what? No. Is that... Okay! Yeah, there's a hint right there. Okay. I thought that looked weird. Okay. That's cute. I saw this the first time I went through and thought, oh, that's just like, that's ambiance. But then I was like, okay, that's probably a thing. Okay, okay. Relic obtained, record link. I have seen many worlds and this is the stupidest of them all. That's some, that's some, uh, that is some real world commentary right there if I ever saw it. Yeah, more autopsy fun, good stuff. Okay, okay. I'm on to you now. Okay, so. Let's see. Hi. Hello. You come here often? Just like press every fucking wall. <laughs> okay, so. Let's go. Okay, that's Binding of Isaac Room. I'm filling in that, in. I'm still filling that in with my imagination. Don't worry, I'm still working on it. What's that I see? Yeah, okay. I'm smart. I saw this. I saw that! I'm on to you. Okay. No. Oh. Can I not? Uh, hello. The relic 
collector. Hey, if you look through the branches here, you can see into the opposite room. Do you see that skeleton? It used to be a little kid. Fantastic. Showed up out of nowhere a while ago. I was already a relic, so I couldn't do anything but watch. Poor thing stayed in that room, confused until it starved and died. I didn't think it was even 10, I don't think it was even 10 years old. I had to watch its little body rotting away and being torn apart by maggots and flies. Not much of a choice for me to look away, you see. This kid is all I think about anymore. I'm glad you're here. Hopefully I can stop thinking about it after we leave the labyrinth. Nostalgia goop. <laughs> Napsta gloop. Okay, we got eight. Eight big old relics. All right. That's Worm World. And, uh, just making sure. Just making sure. Alright. Oh, okay. There's one just like right over here that I miss. Zvi! You're having fun. Okay, Zvi is having the most fun. Zvi is having more fun than anybody in this chat, I think. Right. That is what? Nine relics. Yeah, I could see that one being the first one you find. Uh, it's pretty out in the open. I can see like how you would go this way right from the start. Uh, you, know, you start here and you would just, I mean, you know, sometimes you'd want to immediately just search that way. So, whoa, whoa, okay, hey there, hey there, I saw that, look at that, I'm smart, there's an arrow on the ground, hi, Yo, whoa, Hey there. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. I hope you die, and I hope you die, and I hope you die. Fantastic. I like the dithering here. Uh, this is some incredible work. I like the, the light kind of cascading down the stairs, and as you go up, it's really neat. Relic obtained. Big homie anguish! I am holding out for Big Homie Anguish's mixtape. All right. Small worm writhing inside a doll's body. I know how you feel. And in all honesty, I just really can't take the goddamn, I just really can't take this goddamn shit anymore. Big relate, Big Homie. Big relate, Big Homie. Let's go. Okay. Okay. Big sleepy boy. Oh, there's another one. <laughs> Relic obtained, Eshe. That damned fool Pamphor, even long after our passing, her infernal contraptions just keep on creating life. A never ending flow of useless critters, all living and dying in ignorance. I think I used to help her. Just take what's left of me and go on. I don't want to talk to you anymore. Okay, good. Everybody in this game is so friendly. Pfft. Okay, I found the secret zone. Congratulations, go me. Ah, uh, okay. That's cute. Uh, okay, that's the teleporter. So, okay, we've been through here. Huh? <laughs> um. Hey, 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 check out, check it out. I found a tile that's missing. See this boy right here? 
There's a missing tile. Look like one anyway. <laughs> There's always one! Like, I you remember, like, like, I remember when we were doing Operation Kiss All the Boys and I had to tile out the entire map. Um, I know I certainly probably, there are still probably tiles in that game that I missed. Was it? Oh, I'm missing one. Okay, okay. I am the Hint Machine. I can help you find relics. You know what? Hint system operational. Interact again to dispense hint. In white area, room with an arrow on the ground is symmetrical. Oh, okay, okay. If that's what I'm thinking, that would be... Wait, why am I doing this? Why am I not just using the teleporter? Wait, no, there's no teleporter in the white area. I don't know. Let's walk around. Okay, if it's symmetrical, I know exactly what I probably have to do then. Yep. Okay. Look at that. Boom. It's symmetrical. Oh. Oh my god! <laughs> background I think that this what this is that's what this is so when this game came out somebody had mentioned that uh <laughs> somebody mentioned <laughs> that there was a hell maze right and it, it's nothing against the game at all it's just I hate mazes they make me they make me act they actually just make me mad um, and I had heard that this is a hell maze that repeats and June was kind enough to say, hey, I'll send you something that subtly highlights the path. This is not the... <laughs> this is not what I was told it would be. <laughs> There's a... It's, it, this, is, uh, this is Labyrinth Poly version. I have a feeling June was watching this entire stream for this moment. And oh my god. For it to be the last one I found. That's... Oh, fuck. <laughs> god damn it. Oh my god. Oh man. <laughs> All RPG Maker projects need polyline for for their mazes. This is this is goddamn killing me. Ah. Uh, uh. We all contain Hell Voice. Oh my! After all this time, in my lonely my lonely sentence finally nearing its end. 
Or perhaps you are the relic collector. Either way, I am delighted to finally have the opportunity to get out of this undesirable place. Can you believe they threw me in here for nothing but the tender crime of enjoying myself? I am a tolerant person, but I might want to request some form of reparation for this. In any case, let us make headway. Onwards! Banished for being too horny. That's kind of what I was- that's what I was thinking. You, uh, remember the path you used to get here, right? Don't worry! Don't worry, Hellvoice! I think we're I think we're good. I think we're good. If we go the wrong way. It's like, whoop. Oh my god. That's too good. Oh god. Oh my god, I'm dying. This is too fucking funny. Because I'm now I'm just totally getting lost on purpose. Fucking repeating hell mazes. If the entrance had disappeared. Oh no! <laughs> Oh my god. Whew. I have not had a laugh that good. Did I? I fucking went backwards even having my own goddamn line. I am an it. I am a fucking moron. <laughs> I am a literally. John, where's the polyline and facets? Oh god, that's too good. Oh man. Alright, so now we just go back to, um. We go back to Cyan Land, right? Uh, let's down this way. Let's do this. If I stream, if you'll, you stream it to the end, you'll make a polyline version. <laughs> Okay. Alright. Oh nice, it opened. Alright, hint machine. All relics found. In system inactive. <clears throat> Nothing else? Nothing else in here? You sure? Alright. This little thing right here reminds me of uh the Coheed and Cambria keyworks and keywork insignia in a way. It's got a similar vibe. <clears throat> oh. Wait, wait, wait. The deed is done. E Excuse me? What the fuck? Oh my! <laughs> Whoa! That was fucking cool! That's so good! Oh my god! What a good pity, like the game closed! Oh my god, that's fucking cool as shit! Wow. I'm impressed. Uh, that game was really fucking good. Did I did I find everything? Or is there anything I should go back and, 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 and look for that I missed? Anything that you would like me to show off that I missed, perhaps? Okay, I found it. Like, I didn't expect. I, I, I completely did not. I didn't even know you could do full motion video in uh, RPG Maker. I didn't know that was a fucking thing. That's just. That's why it completely fucking caught me off guard. I thought it was just an image fading in or something, and then it was like, oh, okay, that's cool as shit. That's awesome. June, this is just as rad as Remnants. Like, this is right up there for me. Like, I like them both, like, for, for, for entirely different reasons. Like, this is rad as shit. I think that 
this functions more and works more as just a very ambient and unsettling uh, piece, whereas um, more of a direct story is being told in Remnants, and it's just, it's two entirely different things that I think, like, it's two great tastes to go, but that are doing their own things, and, and they're, they're both my entire jam, so yeah, that is two times in less than a year that you have impressed the shit out of me as uh, a game maker, so my hat is off to you. This game's incredible. I like it a lot. <laughs> It's better than The Witness, absolutely. So, that is Labyrinth, Derelict Abyss. Uh, I will, again, urge people to go check this out. Um, the, the website's in the stream title. Uh, June can link to it uh, if they want uh, as well. So, uh, do y'all feel like uh, hanging out a bit longer? Want to do something else? Because uh, there's something else I've had in I have in mind, uh, and I'll need Beepner's assistance if he's still available. No bonus folder in this one. Yeah, I understand that. Like I, I didn't figure that there was going to be uh, this time around, uh, but I'm still gonna throw it, go throw a few bucks at it. I have to now because you made a version with the polyline in it, so it's just like you got you got to pay for feature. You got to pay for feature creep. Uh, but yeah. Uh, Beepner, are you still around? If you're still around, could you sign on to Discord and join me? Uh, that would be fun. Yo, okay, I'm gonna shoot you a message on Discord, Beepner. Um, hang... You, you hang ten, bruh. While I get this set up, uh, everybody, uh, just hang tight. Alright everybody, so, I'm going to start a voice call now, and hopefully everything works out. <clears throat> Hello. That's loud. Oh, I'm sorry. Wait. You can adjust Wait, my... no, now, now you're quiet. Uh... Oh, uh, you got to give it a couple, <laughs> you got to give it a couple minutes to kind of settle in, I guess. Okay. How's it going? You doing it's okay? Going. We live, we're live on twitch.tv. Oh shit. Yeah. <laughs> Don't don't say all of those offensive things that you were just typing. That would be bad for us both. <laughs> so I got I got you on because we're we're gonna stream something together. Oh, is it um uh is, is it sh shadows of no uh, Im impressions of the dead and, or uh, yeah or what what I it, the, the the one with bra bra. Bro, yeah, you are going to. Voice, I'm a ghost, bro. You're gonna voice all of his lines for us. That's the role I was born to play. Let me let me get the tide stream title updated here. Labyrinth of Toho, Derelict Abyss. There you go. I mean, it's got it's a labyrinth. It's a, it's a labyrinth themed stream. But I'm gonna go ahead and load the game up. You'll need to be watching, of course. But I think I think people will know where we're going. I think people will know what's up. Yeah, you know what? I kind of saw this coming. Well, I mean, we did we did originally stream the other one. It would only make sense. <laughs> <laughs> so, so okay, so yeah. I don't know how how behind. Let me let me refresh uh, the Twitch uh -huh. window. I believe like on average I'm a good 10 to 15 seconds behind yeah. your streams anyway. So, so refreshing it'll help get you caught up at least a little bit. But hey, I figured, you know what? I figured that was going to probably be a shorter game than Remnants, so I thought, why don't we bring why don't we bring it on home? We've been putting this off.
for, for eight so, million years. So yeah. that VTuber dog girl looks pretty different. Is that is that the impression you get from her? I guess the the hair. Yeah, she. Has, well, yeah, no, she's got puppy ears. Or is that puppy ears or is those horns? Because this look like horns to me. They look like puppy ears to me. Mm. It's it's definitely. I like. I get that they're supposed to be horns, but the color palette. In fact, like if she if she did the caramel dancing, like it wouldn't look that <laughs> out of place. But yeah, I figured. You know what? It's about time we do it to them. I think they need to have it done to them. You know we had to. We we na- we have to dab it to them. We have to dab it to them. So I have again, as with the previous dabbing focused video game, I have no idea what this thing's gonna do or say. <laughs> Hopefully it's nothing. Ew. Hopefully it's nothing that'll get us into too much trouble. But I think the people and, and person that's ma- mostly behind this game's writing is uh, coming from a good place. So I don't think it's going to be anything too suspect. Hopefully. Hopefully it's nothing that's going to get you canceled. Oh no! <laughs> now I'm doing a pretty good job of that every time I do a podcast. <laughs> It's gonna happen. Don't worry. All right. So, are we ready? Are you ready to dab on darkness? Let's dab a dab a do it. <laughs> that catchphrase. Yeah. All right. All right. Z z z. Dab. Oh, we're we're dreaming about dabs. It looks like. This is already good. This is this is Super Mario Brothers too. Yes. Ah. That was a nice dream. I can't remember the last time I had a dream like that. Come to think of it, I feel rather good today, actually. It actually took me less than an hour to finally get out of bed. I can't relate to this at all. I guess now I'll just relax with some video games and see where the day takes me. I could even work on that thing I've been meaning to... Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hold it right there! Now that's the, that's what I'm talking about. Anytime I'm like, "Hey, I should work on something," that's the voice I immediately hear in my head. Huh? What? I'm gonna is... get so much done today. No, you're doing dishes for the entire day. <laughs> is that a sense of positivity I smell? I uh, you're supposed to be depressed and in bed until noon. You're also definitely not supposed to have a positive outlook on today. Oh, oh. Uh, this character's name Card Sins, and I'm very angry. Car- Car- Card Sins Daily? Card Sins Daily. <laughs> I hate that they just took the word darkness and made two nonsense names out of it. That makes me mad. <laughs> I swear, what's wrong with you humans? It seems like you're just destined to be miserable for your entire life, but one small positive thing happens and all of a sudden life isn't so bad to you anymore. We can't have that now, can we? Man, this game just gets me, I think. <laughs> I I can barely stand up. Who are you? Oh, of course. My name is Card Sins. I'm the I'm the physical manifestation of the darkness inside you. As you know by now, I am extremely powerful, all thanks to you. But alas, you just had to go thinking that you were gonna have a good day today. I quite like having this form, but I can't. Um, I, but I can't maintain it if you're not feeling me enough. But if you're not feeling feeding me enough negativity, so why don't you go back to bed and lay down there until 12:13 p.m., wishing you would permanently go back to sleep. This game. I hate that I relate so much. Oh, it can't okay. manifest unless you listen to Limp Biscuits break stuff on a loop until you go back to sleep. <laughs> All right, beat me. You got two choices here. You, are, are okay, you... I'm. I'm waiting for it to catch up. Okay. Uh, and they say all Helltaker characters look alike. Right. <laughs> so, <laughs> no way or I want to die. Um, okay, so long as uh, nobody's going to call a wellness check on I mean, let's just say I want to die. <laughs> I was going to pick two. <laughs> I want to die. You're right. Being no, wait, happy. I meant I meant I want to thee. It's right, it's <laughs> German thee. for thee. I want to D. Being happy when you're this miserable takes effort. A lot of effort. 
It's not a mindset or a switch I can flip on and suddenly be happy. It's a long, enduring process that takes everything you have. I'm tired of all of this. I'm going to bed now. That's right. I know what's best for you, and I always know how you should feel and act. Have a good, long sleep. Higurashi laugh inserted here. I think we just got the bad. <laughs> bad ending number one. You are swallowed by your inner darkness and hope for a normal life looks extremely bleak. Damn. Does, uh, does anybody in the chat have a time to bad ending? Number time one? to bad ending. We have already achieved it. <laughs> it's not too late, though. The voice from your dreams. Oh, it's still going. We got a bad ending, but it's still going. This is the voice from your dreams. Hey, I know it's really hard to want to get better. I can't speak for how you feel, and I'm not here to judge you, but maybe one day it'll start to hurt less. And maybe one day it'll start to get better. And maybe one day you'll be glad you stuck around to be alive in the moment. Maybe there's hope. Perhaps there's, perhaps there's underlying issues that make you want to die. Perhaps there's nothing that can be done to fix it, but rather there's something to make it hurt less. Perhaps neither applies. All are perfectly valid. But whenever you're ready, you're always free to seek the right resources for your, for your situation. That's all I have to say for now. What you do next is in your hands. So do we, we, we probably want to retry that. I can't believe we're being forced into happiness. I'm kind of bummed. I'll let it catch up for you a bit. Can we get back to the prompt? Well, at least it's giving us a choice. It didn't just dump us out of the e executable. Yeah. <laughs> imagine, imagine making a video game where it just dumps you out, dumps you back to the desktop. What kind of amateur bullshit hour is that? <laughs> God, I'm, why do people keep me around as a friend? <laughs> All right, are we back to the prop, Beepner? Are you ready? Are you ready to say no way? Are you ready to fight back? No way, Jose. No way, Jose. Hmm? What's that? I refuse! Nothing you can say or do will stop me from trying to have a good day for once in my life. Well, alright. Wait, that's it? Giving up already? Kinda lame if you ask me, to be honest. Like, why would you Why would you be having that argument with you? Wait a minute, my depression is giving up that easily? <laughs> that seems like a dumb thing to be arguing back against. It's like, if I can get my depression to shut up that quickly, I'd be like, okay, sure. Well, course. this is a lot cheaper than therapy. Yeah. <laughs> of course not. I can't hurt you physically, but I can convince you that you're simply just not worth it. Eh. Hmm, there's a lot of there's a lot to work with here. I wonder where I, what I should start with. Oh, I know, for starters, how about this? You'll never accomplish anything decent. You peaked in your life years ago, and it really doesn't get better than this. God, this game's just not making me feel good. <laughs> Look at you. Most of the time it takes you a while to even do anything remotely productive. Oh my god. <laughs> you'll, you'll never please a woman. Alright, now that was just uncalled That's for. That's just uncalled for. <laughs> You're going to be trapped forever in this endless cycle, so why even try? You're exactly the person you never wanted to grow up to be. Oh man, we've got three choices now. <laughs> I'm cheating. I'm cheating. I'm cheating. I'm dropping. Dropping a save. Alright. We got three choices, Beepner. It doesn't matter what you think of me. It's not about being productive. You got a point. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I might need a <laughs> God. I think we want to do the bad one, don't we? Sarah is in this game and is upset. All right, Sarah is in this game and is upset. So, so Sayara is the reason we're choosing you have a point. Yes, blame it on Sayara. Way to go, Sayara! <laughs> blame it on Sayara. <laughs> yeah, Revan's been supplanted as there the scapegoat. Yes, finally! Blame Sayara. It's a new hashtag going around Twitter. Alright, you're right. I won't amount to anything. I might as well just stop deluding myself. There's no point in trying. I'll go back to bed now. I'm glad you quickly realized how worthless you are. Don't worry, I'll take good care of you. We have a mutual relationship. Really, I'm the one saving you from more harm, and in return... <laughs> what is the spit wad flying out of, <laughs> out of her mouth? 
like, really? I'm the one saving you from more harm, and in return, I get to maintain this lovely form that's strong, that's strong enough to keep you in check like this. <laughs> Bad ending number two. Crippled by anxiety, you spend the rest of your life dissatisfied with yourself and afraid to try going out of your comfort zone. You could never achieve the things you really wanted to do in life. Rude. <laughs> but there's still a chance! Hey, I'm not here to tell you what you should and shouldn't do, but sometimes doing things you're scared of is exactly what you need to re need to realize that things are never as bad as your mind makes them out to be. <clears throat> it's also important not to fall for the mindset that you have to complete something in X amount of time or you're a failure. I Man, I think like all of us could like are are benefiting from this one right now. Just go at your own pace. Whatever works for you. Furthermore, perhaps it's best to understand that worrying about what others say or expectations that others have placed upon you isn't, isn't important. Other people may have their expectations, but ultimately you have to live with the life you want. You have to live the life you want to live. Of course, perhaps it's not the other people. Of course, perhaps it's not other people that stop you. Maybe it's your own self that's stopping you. In any case, it's a good start to identify what is stopping you. Uh, you, what is stopping you of accomplishing what you want to do and tackling them through the best means available to you? Either through therapy, talking to a friend, or relaxing and unwinding with your favorite hobbies. Whatever works for you. And finally, remember that the only person you have, the only person you have to amount to is the person that's happy with yourself. That's all I have to say for now. What you do next is in your hands. I mean, we got, okay. we got people ta typing in Cockney accents in the chat. What are you doing this? Why, you, why are people talking in Cockney accents? Your feet, and them over. And them over. And them over. I get that's a joke. This good hand. <laughs> I think that's the joke, isn't it? Sure. I don't understand <laughs> British comedy because it's not actually funny. Uh, oh, well, actually, if you watch the original Monty Python, um, yeah, I don't know. Am I, I, I like Beef Show. Okay, am I the only person that actually doesn't give a shit about Monty Python? I think if somebody doesn't give a shit about Monty Python and they, um, A, know what, even know about it, because I think Monty Python fans, like, have this mistaken impression that it's more widely known than it is. Mm -hmm. Um... If somebody doesn't like it, they'll they'll probably be pretty quick to point it out. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Because I, I don't I don't think it's very funny. Like, and, and when people go and they they repeat dumb memes from it, I'm just I'm. Polly, Polly, it's okay though because people aren't repeating Monty Python anymore. It's been supplanted by Rick and Morty. I, yeah. Have, have you seen Rick and Morty? Because because you gotta you gotta see Rick and Morty. You gotta see the Szechuan sauce. You see, like it's that or pickle it's, Rick. It's it's that it's funniest shit I've ever seen. And and literally every person in the world thinks that I know what a JoJo reference is. They no, but everybody. see, but see, but JoJo people think everything is a JoJo reference. Like lamp, JoJo reference. That's a JoJo. Reference. There was a lamp in the background in episode thirty-six of season four. That lamp is on a stand. I wonder what its oh, stand yuck. is. Oh, yuck. This is my stand, blinded by the light. Oh, because uh, because they're all songs from, from right, rock and roll. You right. get it? Yeah, I. I there, there's a guy. There's a character who's a ripoff of David Bowie. Yep, there, there very much is. All you need to know about JoJo is that every fighting game like has a just straight up lifts JoJo characters. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and 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 that it's really boring. It's not as exciting as people think it is. Anyway. And also, they, they pose in uh, contortions that humans, like, physically cannot do. Yeah. <laughs> but God, man, JoJo fans, please, just shut the fuck up, we know. Okay? Like, that's all I want. Just shut the fuck up. And that was how Polly got kicked off of Twitch. Yep, that'll be it. That shut a stand. Line. I get it. Ah! Made a double entendre. Boom! All right. So... Okay, so it's not about being productive. Okay, it's not about being productive. <laughs> it's about having really great takes on things that people pretend to like that they think are, <laughs> that they think are good. 
All right. Just because I'm not working on I the think next... Monty Python's okay, for the record. <laughs> Trying to pull yourself out of this fire. Like, you were on board with JoJo, but you think maybe if you backpedal a little bit away from me, you're not going to get burnt quite as bad? That's what's going on here. Just because I'm not working on the next greatest thing so in my life doesn't mean I'm not worth it. As long as I'm happy with where my life is going, then nothing else matters. I don't need to work 12 hours a day like a guinea pig for the sake of being productive. Now she has a neon pretzel coming out of her head. She does. I don't need to fit your definition of productivity. I just have to be happy with who I am. Oh wow, I honestly did not expect that. I got, I got a, an achievement for standing up for yourself. Good job, Beepner. You did it. <laughs> Ray. Not many people fight against their internal feelings like this. Usually they just try to block out or suppress their feelings and pretend everything is fine. Well, then it seems pretty stupid that you physically manifest yourself like that on top of telling me all this. Eh, I just love to hear myself talk. Well, at least she's honest. Speaking of that, there's still plenty of subject matter to go with you. Time for round two. She is going to cut your ass down now. You are in for it. Since when are we keeping score? You did a lot of embarrassing things when you were younger. Uh-oh. Block her punch, then counter punch, Mac. <laughs> we're done. Join the Nintendo Fun Club, Beepner. <laughs> it doesn't matter how hard you try. What you did can never be taken back. You still think of those shameful moments. I bet they keep you up at night all the time since you, can, you, since you can't just help but remember them. Before you sleep, you think of these moments. When you go to take a shower, you think of these moments. When you play video games and the loading screen causes a black screen which reflects your face, you think of these moments. You're drilling a little deep here. <laughs> when you get the courage to try to do anything outside of your comfort zone, you'll think of these moments. Those people will never define you by your actions back then. Believe me, you're better off this way, staying in your room as much as you can. You'll save yourself the trouble of embarrassing yourself again, and other people won't have to be reminded of your past failures. <laughs> it's too real. John had the black screen thing happen yesterday. <laughs> Alright, we're going to drop another save. Boom. Alright. What do you say? Do, do we just give in? I think, we're, I think that's the pattern. Let's give in. We're just going to give in and we're just going to tell her she's right. Give her what she wants. Yep. You're right. What's the point of doing anything if I'm going to be mocked and ridiculed for what I do? Life is about building a legacy that other people can remember me for. And if I can't do that, what's the point? Exactly. I'm glad you get it. If you, if you, I'm glad you get it. If you can't make a name for yourself, then you're a nobody. And considering how other people already hate you and mock you, there's no hope for you. Even if you don't say it with your face, they already think of you as a loser, or will once they actually see you trying to do anything. So why don't you kill me? <laughs> like I said, I'm doing you and society a favor by keeping you in check like this. Now back to bed with you. Bad ending number three. Always self-conscious about what others might think or say about what you do, you become more you become afraid of doing most of the things you wanted to accomplish and could she never. She just wants sleep. to make sure you're getting enough sleep. Exactly. I, I think that I, as somebody who has struggled most of the year to get enough sleep, <laughs> I'm pretty okay with this bitch visiting me and putting me to sleep. <laughs> There's still hope, though. It's the voice from your dreams again. I know it can be hard to understand the meaning of our lives. We long for a purpose and to be needed by other people. Of course, it often seems like we're not needed in society, that the world functions and moves, the function functions and moves on regardless of us or not. And that if we don't make a name for ourselves, we might as well not exist, right? It's true, there may very well be a time where the last person who ever knew us will be gone and our names will fade away forever. But that doesn't have to matter. It's okay to not it's okay, it's okay to not lead a life that will be remembered in the history books. It's okay to just be happy with how you live. You don't need to be a part of something greater or leave a behind a legacy. It's okay to lead a simple life as long as you're content and satisfied with the way things are. Why change that? Let, let go of the expectations of society and your peers and think about what 
I think, I think about what would truly make you happy and work towards that. One of the biggest regrets people have on their deathbeds is that they followed the lives of other people expected for them and not their own. If you're free to struggle and not if if you are free to struggle and not struggling to be free, then you always have a choice. Make the right one for yourself and other people. That's all I have to say for now. What you do next is in your hands. Does the voice from your dreams ever get tired of your shit? I my the voice in my dreams wants to throw me out three windows three of them exactly three windows it wants to line up mm. windows like in a row and put me through all three of them and then i fall out of the building or, or how about just throw you from one window and you're falling and then you you hit two more on the way down that'd be kind of fun don't you think i mean you're, you're gonna die anyway so i think kind of like smashing through some windows and like you could try to do some cool poses on the way down Okay, so like, if you really get off on being thrown out of windows, mm -hmm. is that autoerotic defenestration? I'm out. You can do the rest of this yourself. Okay, I'm gonna pick, uh... But, why isn't the mouse moving? <laughs> I, th I think this game's broken. <laughs> oh no. I can't, I, Polly, I can't control it. <laughs> I'll let you off this time. This one time! Why am I bitching at people for making bad jokes when that's literally my entire brand? All right, what are we doing? Because you're feeling about... threatened. I'm never threatened. You motherfucker. All right. So, who cares about what other people think or the past is not important? How would you answer? Uh... Well, I always care about what other people think, so I'm going to say the past is not important. All right, the past is not important. Sure, I may have made mistakes in the past, mistakes that I might have done differently if I were to do them again. But hey, I'm here, I'm right here, and I turned out relatively okay. <laughs> well, I'm glad we turned out only relatively okay. We're being honest here, at least. Well, like, at least I'm not Hitler. <laughs> Come on, put things in perspective. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, so maybe I still wouldn't change a thing. I don't have to define myself by any of the past mistakes as long as I move on from them. If anything, it's a good thing to make mistakes. Recognizing them as much, recognizing them as such means I've learned from them and grew as a person. There's no point in avoiding new things in life just because I might mess up. I won't let fear prevent me from being the person I want to be. With regards to the thoughts that I get... Alright, we got another choice. She hasn't even started berating us yet. Same, so... You want to accept those thoughts, you can force, you, you can focus on better thoughts, or you have to fight them. Uh, let's see. I'm, I'm kind of interested in what the response is going to be if, if, if this, if this choice matters, mm -hmm. uh, with I have to fight them. All right. Oh, fight your thoughts. That's right. Anytime I get a negative thought, I just have to do my best to block it out of my mind and counter it with another thought denying it. <clears throat> wow, what a brilliant idea! Why don't you try to fight it right now? I'm sure it'll work out wonderfully. Oh no, I Bring think it we on. did it dumb. Take this! The card assaults you with a constant stream of negative thoughts and emotions. <laughs> <laughs> As you try to counter the thoughts with an attempt to push it away, the negative forces only seem to grow stronger. No way! Do you see now, the more you try to resist, the stronger it becomes. You're mine. Ah! We died, I think. Bad ending number four. You spend the rest of your nice. days ashamed, anxious, filled with self-loathing and doubt for yourself as intrusive thoughts plague your mind non-stop. Again, this is literally every day. <laughs> Afraid of trying new things and forever crippled with internal strife, you never become truly satisfied and content with your life. But you can still make things right. Hey, how's it going, Raven? Welcome. Okay, the voice in your dreams has another word for you, Beepner. Alright. D. Hey, listen. A. B. D. <laughs> Yeah, where's the dabs? We are so there's a there's a distinct lack of dabbing and a lot more sadding. Is dab spelled backwards as sad? 
Or no, wait, that's just my that's, keyboard is that's... messed up. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops. Sorry, everybody. I got I got stuck on European style again. I mean, Belmont spelled backwards is Dracula. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, the more you try to block out, deny, or fight your intrusive thoughts, the worse you'll end up making it. Don't try to engage with these thoughts. They're just thoughts. They do not hold any meaning to them. Understand that these thoughts are entirely normal and uh, nor entirely normal to have, and that there's nothing wrong with, with you for having them. Instead, accept them. Allow them to pass through your mind, accept them, and let them go freely, no matter how unpleasant they may seem. Focus on the present and continue to do anything that requires your immediate attention. Furthermore, you can imagine your anxious thoughts as a ridiculous little cartoonish thing that you shouldn't take seriously. Like the, the character <laughs> that we, we've been talking to. Oh, I thought you were going to say like John. Or John. John. I, I, I feel that like if I imagined anything as John, I could, I could just fucking crush it. Just destroy. Annihilate. <laughs> Diminishing your anxious thoughts as, as silly little... As a silly little entity, rather than something serious or menacing, can help put you at ease. <clears throat> That's all I have to say for now. What you do next is in your hands. Okay. The power is it's yours. yours. <clears throat> all right. So we're not going to fight our thoughts. So are we going to accept them? Which I think that's kind of what the thing already told us to do. Or we can focus on better thoughts. <clears throat> yeah. Focus on better thoughts? Yeah, let's see what that one says. I have, I think I kind of have a feeling of where they're going to go with she, that one. She seems pleased with our answer. That's probably a bad thing. Yeah. <laughs> I can focus my mind on better activities. Ones Flawless victory. <laughs> ones that are in the moment. I can take up fun, healthy activities that occupy my mind and keep me away from the nasty, intrusive thoughts of the past. As long as these activities are fun and not harmful, it's perfectly valid. I can watch anime, play video games, go for a run, anything to keep my mind busy. Ha! Most of those things are just a waste of time. They're healthy outlets I can use to have fun and de-stress myself. That's pretty valuable in itself. As long as they have a clear, positive value on my life, then I don't need to worry about what you or other people say. Oh yeah? I don't think you'll be enjoying those activities when you're attacked, attacked with non-stop events from the past! Okay. A one-word response. Hello! You're supposed to be engaging with me here! As Card begins to visibly seethe, you load up your favorite online competitive multiplayer... That's a lie. I've never liked an online competitive multiplayer game. I've, I've My immersion is gone. I suppose I could pretend I'm playing Quake 3. Hello? Did we lose you? No, I'm here. Okay. Um... Oh, telephone? Yeah, no, it's nothing. <laughs> I'm sorry. If you need to go, like, I, I mean, I, it won't hurt my feelings if you need to go. I do, what, who do you think I am? You think anybody would, like, call me or, like, I would have a need to leave the house? I mean, I'd hang out with you if I could. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, we're not supposed to be doing that because of COVID. No, that would, yeah, that would be a very... <laughs> As card begins to visibly see, you load up your favorite online competitive multiplayer game. You find a match quickly. Just as you select your character, card begins to launch a surprise attack. No, you don't. Now that's where my immersion is broken. Finding match quickly. <laughs> You're not sitting in the queue for like 30 minutes. Beefing over here playing Splatoon. <laughs> no, Splatoon just. Splatoon just. The other players have disconnected. <laughs> oh no! Remember that time you told a joke in school and no one laughed? And no. then another kid just said it louder and everyone laughed? <laughs> That's fucking happened to me. <laughs> oh yeah, that happened. Now, what character do I want to play? As you select your character and begin the match of the game, card strikes again. Hey, hey! Right remember that time you were too scared to ask your crush out? <laughs> Boy, how stupid you felt back then, am I right? I bet you feel stupid right now! No, see, the only winning move is not to play. Exactly. Yeah, that was a thing that happened. Now, what do I do to win the? Do, now, what do I do to win with this character? You, you know, one thing I should. Nah. You focus on your game, and despite your best efforts, you end up losing the match. Ha! <laughs> See, look at that. No matter how hard you try, you can't win. Just like that time you studied a test and got a really bad score. Well, <laughs> fuck you, fuck you, lady. She's going deep. 
She's just going hard, man. Yeah, it was a hard test. Now, what shall I do next? Oh, I know. I can start working on drafting ideas for my next project. Man, I've got like 8,000 Game Maker projects open and there's like none of them have evolved to actually a game. <laughs> I, I have zero because I have no ideas of my own. That's okay. You can have some of mine. I'll give... <laughs> Holly card 64. There you go. There you go. I'll let you be the one to figure out, like, 3D uh, gaming. Uh, you can figure that shit out. Um, yeah, isn't it just install Unity and then, like, click the make 3D game? Yeah. I, EXE. Well, well, you can actually do that in Godot. You, you can actually go into Godot and say, make 3D game. <laughs> now, what you do beyond that point... I couldn't fucking tell you, but I do know that Godot has a make 3D game button. <laughs> hey, let's go over that time you... That's it. I know what I must do. Oh, what are you going to do now? Fight me? Finally, I've been waiting for this. Nope. I'm going to go do something even better. Huh? What What do you mean? What's, what are you going to do? You begin to flex your arms a bit and stretch them out. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Beep, are, are, we it, it's, are we? Is this the climax? I think this might be the climax. Hold, hold on, we need some uh, <laughs> dramatic music. Actually, does this thing have music? I I, I don't know. It's yeah, it's like... just really soft piano theme oh. going on. Somebody looked up visual novel music, and this is the first choice that was there, and this is what they picked. <laughs> That's the impression. Hey, what's something soft and backgroundy that I can find on the Creative Commons? <laughs> yeah. Uh, you begin to flex your arms a bit and stretch them out. No! Don't do it! Please, anything but that! Oh, no. She's afraid of the dab. You move your left elbow as close to your face as possible. Everybody in chat better be following along. Get that elbow as close to your face as possible, Beepner. I'm gonna... I'm, 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 I'm doing it. Can all right, hear, all right. Can you hear me? I think my... I don't think you can hear me that well. I can hear you. I can hear you. You're good. All <laughs> okay, right. Okay. She's, she's scared now. She is very... Yeah, my mouth is in my elbow. I... <laughs> <laughs> it's good. How long do I have to do this? She's not She's not done yet. She's screaming us to stop, though. But you stretch your right arm as far and wide as possible away from your face. You have now completed the fattest, meanest dab you have ever done in your entire life. <laughs> Don't dab on me! <laughs> we know the devil. We know. Oh, that would be a better game than We Know the Devil. That that hurt to think of, and it hurt even more to say it. Mm. Oh no, we we Final Fantasy killed her. Like, she just had a death animation. What a world, what a world! I am in control of my own destiny, not other people, not society, and certainly not what you have to say. <laughs> <laughs> well, I wonder what I'll do now. Good ending number two. What? Congratulations, you successfully faced the darkness through focusing your mind on better things. This is good ending number two. Okay, we are got we got to go back. we got to roll it back. Okay, so I think we have to accept them. I think focusing on better thoughts was like, that's good. That's a good way I of fighting back. I seriously thought that one was going to be another bad end. Well, it was a good end. I think that's a good thing. I think that, like, using distractions to... Yeah, it was just, it was just the, um... The choice kind of yeah. led me to believe, well, they clearly don't want you to go with that one. Yeah, because the bad ending basically told you that you have to accept those thoughts. So that's what we're doing now. So I think get, you probably need to get those arms ready, Beepner, because we are I, probably about to deliver the fattest, meanest dab of our life once more. I think I think I'm too out of shape to actually I don't know. hold this, the dab for the duration. <laughs> you can't. <laughs> All right. It's like I'm not posing for a figure drawing class here <laughs> nobody wants that no all right we have to accept those thoughts Boopner. Brett Brett posed for a figure drawing class but nobody could fit his dick on the page <laughs> there's not enough canvas in the world for that dick 
I realize now that I just have to accept these thoughts. They're only thoughts just passing by, like water on a flowing stream. The more I try to push it back, the stronger it will grow. The stronger it'll grow. I simply have to let it go and move about with my day. Make my monster grow! I was, yeah, I was kind of, I was mentally there as well. <laughs> It's just a thought, not an impulse. It doesn't have any value unless I give it value. As long as I let it pass by, it can't harm me. So you're saying you're just going to ignore me. I'm not going to ignore you. Go ahead and barrage me with whatever thoughts you want right now. You think you can just accept what a miserable pile of garbage you are, lady? Have you seen my Twitter? <laughs> Come on now! I am far beyond acceptance. <laughs> Is it, wasn't that, that that um Pantera album, Far Beyond Acceptance? Far Beyond Acceptance, yes. <laughs> You're a loser. No one likes you. Your friends are only pre your pre your friends only pretend to deal with you. You don't deserve to be sad like this. Other people have it way worse than you do. You know. I accept and allow these thoughts. What the actual? Just like that? Are you seriously going to simply accept what I have to say? Yeah. You're extremely sensitive and weak. You don't like confrontation. Your penis is tiny. Whoa, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> it's cold. <laughs> yeah, it's very cold in the middle of summer. Wait, is this the hentai ending? Oh, my. It might be. Are there cucumbers? <laughs> <laughs> That's DLC. Man, I still remember when we were, like, making that joke. It was like, it's gonna be hentai. And, like, as soon as she appeared, it's just like, why does she have a sperm on her hat? <laughs> well, this one had the sperm sprite flying it's out of her mouth. Flying so. out of her mouth. Right, right, right. You don't like confrontation. You hate yourself. And you're dumb. God damn. Just completely fucking owned. That's it. How do you come back from that? Like this has got to be another bad ending. There's no way you there's no way you pull out of this nosedive. And you're stupid. And you're lazy. And you keep embarrassing yourself because you're useless. I accept and allow these thoughts because each and every one are true. <laughs> ah! Actually, I do have one thing to show you. Uh uh zip. <laughs> <laughs> Yes! <laughs> I've, I've finally gotten through to you. Are you going to engage or deny any of these things I've said to you? Oh, she's going to grab it, too. Oh, yep. She's got... <laughs> <laughs> nope. I'm going to do something even better. Huh? What do you mean? You began to flex your arms a bit and stretch them out. All right, everybody, let's do it again. We owe it. We owe this bitch one more. One more! Let's do a big common Rider Henshin style circle and then... Yeah! 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 No, don't do it! Please, <laughs> anything but that! You move your left elbow as close to your face as possible. No! Stop! You stretch your right arm as far and wide as possible away from your face. You have now completed the fattest, meanest dab you have ever done in your entire life. Good job. I'm very proud of you. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The cream will rise to the top. The cream will rise to the top, Hogan. Seriously, what a joke. Well, time to take it easy. Good ending number one. Congratulations. You successfully faced the darkness through accepting and allowing it instead of trying to fight or block it out. I think that's the game. Well, I, well, I want to cast Magic Missile. You want to cast Magic Missile. I don't think there's any more endings. I think that's it. Like, I don't know, like, what else we could have chosen. Hmm. Let's do a quick run through here. Uh, no way. Uh, it doesn't matter what you think of me. It's not being productive. Okay, like, didn't... Were, were these two, um... Like, do you... Uh, were these two bad endings and then just one good ending? I can't remember. But I think we got them all. Did we pick it doesn't matter what you think of me? We'll see. Okay, we didn't. 
because I'm, I'm holding control and we haven't seen this dialogue. Okay, so uh, it, doesn't, okay. it doesn't matter what you think of me. <laughs> okay, I really couldn't care less about what you think of me. You may be a part of me, but your statements have absolutely zero value to me because you have nothing of value to contribute other than the leech off of my happiness. So, so if she's a part of you and y'all do the sexy time, is that technically masturbating? That's probably masturbating. You get to masturbate, but it's like a girl you. I mean, she doesn't look like you, I would assume, so you're basically, you know, hey, cute devil girl, why not, right? <laughs> as long as I at least try to believe that, I'll be okay. Oh wow, I honestly did not expect that. Not many people fight against their internal feelings like this. Usually they just try to block out or suppress their feelings and pretend everything is fine. Then it seems pretty stupid that you physically manifest yourself like that on top of telling me all this. <clears throat> I just love to hear myself talk. Okay, I think that that's where... Yeah, and we, I know Okay, we, so it branches back yeah. into the same thread. <laughs> yeah, like... Like, the yeah, who cares about what other people think? The past is not important. You're right, yeah. Other people don't matter, especially those who linger on the past. <clears throat> if people dislike me for any mistakes I might have made in the past, that's their problem, not mine. I don't have to care about what they have to say. Only those who are willing to see me for who I really am matter. I just have to keep moving forward and those who are with me along every step of the way towards, towards that are the ones that I should be sticking around with. Even if I have to do it alone, that's fine too. There's no point in avoiding new things just because I'm afraid of what other people might think of me. The only person I have to live for is myself, not anyone else. With regards to the thoughts I get... Okay, now I think that we just kind of... Yeah. And now we just... Yeah. Alright. So I think that's kind of everything. So, I so, guess... So does that character believe in a thing called love? You, you get it. The darkness. It's, yes, it's the darkness. darkness. <laughs> her, her name is Darkness. I got you. I got you. And we, we dab on her. We dab on the dar darkness. Dabbed right all over that darkness. The biggest feet. The biggest. Just, just hit that dab right all over her face. Just boom. Just, just, just drop a big steamy dab right her on her chest. Her face is just dripping with dabness. Just all down her chin, on her chest. It's just gross. A little Beepner. dabble, do you? A little dabble, do you? Beepner, thanks for joining me. Uh, <laughs> this was an absolute uh, thanks, pleasure. Thanks for, <laughs> thanks for inflicting this idiocy upon <laughs> was it an unsuspecting really, populace. <laughs> was it really idiocy? I, I think that was pretty uplifting. I think that, like, yeah, look... Yeah, like 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 the other game, it had to be pretty general about things because it's it only it only called us stupid and lazy and dumb and a failure and and I think it's doing that you know obviously because those are the <laughs> thoughts that people like us have. So I think that was a cute. Oh, I gotta thing. take my meds. <laughs> <laughs> I think that was a cute little thing, just as much as the uh, just as much as the Sakia one. Um, it's trying to do something, put some kind of positive energy out there, and who can fucking blame anybody for that right now, you know? Thanks, Ryan, and then one nine oh eight. Yep. Good job, everybody. All right. So, Beepner, I'm gonna go ahead and tell you bye, 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 bye. Kick, kick me right the fuck out of the call. Get out of my call. Boom. There, did it, everybody. Punted that motherfucker. Just yeeted him completely out. But well, thanks everybody for coming out. This was a fun little evening. June, once again, thank you for an amazing, amazing game. Feel free to drop the link once and uh, again in chat for Labyrinth. It was a great, great little experience. Uh, and we will go ahead and put that back up on the screen one last time while I find somebody to host slash raid. Remember, if you stick around for the raid, you get extra points, so you could spend those towards them knee paws later when Higurashi starts back up on, like, the 14th or so. So, Dr. Doobaloob, Dr. Doobaloob is over here. He's streaming some Astral Chain, and he needs some love. Ain't nobody over there, so let's send him some love. I'm going to be sure to stick around, say hi to Dr. Doobie, and we will catch you sometime. Probably Monday. I don't know. Wait, I didn't. There.
There we go. There's the title. All right. Catch you later, everybody. Take it easy. Much love.